Amaka. Please get up. Good morning, love. Good morning. I need to ask you something very important. Mm -hmm. And I want you to tell me the truth. Do not lie to me. Did you take any money? I mean, dollars, foreign currency, from your father's briefcase. Don't lie to me. No, I did not. Are you sure? Yes. Then, what could have happened to the money? Who could have taken it? from Wamaka's room. I went to search it, but I didn't see the money. I even asked her. She said she doesn't know where the money is. Oh, but that's not what I asked you. Kedegom, where is my money? Where is it? Baby, I am not a thief. I have never stolen all my life. I didn't take your money. I didn't take your money. Urgent appointment this morning. You are, you, you, you're so lucky. Listen to me. If I come back, I don't want to see you in this house again. If this really happened, then you must do something very, very fast. If I how could you harbor such a thief in the name of your wife? Knowing fully where that she's responsible for those diabolical acts. You beat me. Honestly, I still can't believe my wife did this. And this is a woman who has lived with me for many years. Many years. You know, and, and she's been there for me through thick and thin. I mean, the thing that my, my own wife could steal from me. Beats me. Sweetheart, I'm all right. Um, 
mommy is passing through tough times emotionally but I will be fine and why are you packing your bags? where are you going to? not going anywhere I'm just trying to arrange my things mom stop crying stop crying huh? It's okay. You have to be courageous. You have to be strong. You have to have faith. What, what is this? No, don't tell me you want to leave just because he threatened you must leave. No, this is your home. You own this place with him. He is your husband. You cannot leave this place for them. Look, Master Jesus Christ has a sized power and authority over sin and death. And because he was in union with his Father and the Holy Spirit. And Jesus just says, cut off from here, you can do nothing. You have to be in union with Christ for you to achieve this. It's okay, it's okay. I must talk to your husband. You cannot leave this place for them. It's okay. It's okay. You can't leave this place for them. It's okay. It's all right. It's okay. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. No, it's all right. It's all right. It's all right, please. It's all right. It's all right. Even though you love from your heart, they will hate you. For no reason For even for those of you you sacrificed We leave you With our remorse They will accuse you They will cause you They will try to tear you down But in the end What are you doing here? Huh? What are you still doing here? My uh, brother, I understand how you feel. But for God's sake, don't give the devil a chance. Give me a patient hearing, okay? For the same God who has been faithful to you all these years. And for the respect you have for me as your spiritual director. Please, calm down. Sit down, please. I'm not in the mood to sit down. Tell me what you want to say. Where I can understand. listening. Very well then. You see, I strongly believe that your wife here is innocent. I'm not trying to exonerate or extricate her. But I know she's innocent. Excuse me. You know she's innocent? Huh? You're telling me that this, this lady here is innocent? So who stole my money? No, tell me. You want me to believe you're innocent? So who stole my money? A ghost? A ghost came into this house? Opened my briefcase, took my money and hid in your bag. Is that what you want me to believe? Tell me now, I'm listening. Father, is that the, the, the rubbish she sold to you and you believed it hook, line and sinker? Chakolo, one day. Father, in a general No, seriously, I'm not joking. In a Calm down. It's not what you think. Father, for the respect I have for you and for the fact that Amanda and I have come a long way, 
She's been there for me through thick and thin. I will forgive her. I'll give her a second chance. But if this happens again, Father, Ayokwanambiko, don't beg me because I will take an action that will be drastic. Okwata, she will leave my house. Don't beg me. Thank you very much. I'm forgiving her. I'm assuring that nothing of this kind shall repeat itself again in this house. Thank you. Darling, I hope all is well. Your face doesn't look good. How will all be well? Of course, all is not well. How will my face look good? You're happy now. Huh? You've succeeded. You have succeeded. Clap for yourself. We did go happy. Huh? You prophesied that, that that business, that refinery deal was going to be a flop, and that's exactly what happened. All the money I invested in that deal, gone. Everything. All because of you, evil woman. You have bewitched that business. You're all, all are core, core. You're happy now, right? Evil woman, oh, 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 prophet of doom. Don't, don't say one word to me. Sweetheart, you have to cheer up. Seriously, you can't continue torturing yourself emotionally because you lost so much money on a business which can happen to anybody. You don't even understand what's going on. It's not so much money. It's not some money. It's all my money. All my savings. All the money I have just like that gone into this business. And I know where, I know what went wrong. All my wife. I, I have evil mind and evil heart towards this evil thoughts towards this business she kept on saying all sorts of rubbish that the business will not work it will flop or flop go now Nancy. baby i understand okay i understand perfectly well but i still insist that you take it easy well i have a solution you know i have met people especially top politicians i know of one who i can talk to so he can introduce you into his own line of business all you have to do is try investing this time around and i can assure you that it's going to be genuine and successful okay just give it a try what, what will i invest you don't even understand and i'm not even new you don't even understand the problem Fine, you can take me to someone who will introduce me to a new line of business. Beautiful. What will I invest? My head? Eh? Where will I get the money from? You don't even understand. Keep on guessing where they're going to get you invest. Baby, it is simple. All you have to do is take a bank loan. As soon as you make your profit, you pay back and still have your business. Okay? I'll, I'll give it a thought. Thank you. Good day, Sophia. How are you doing? Good day, Mama. I'm good. Yeah, good day. My name is OJ. OJ Oil and Gas. Oh, OJ Oil and Gas. We're meeting Waziko. Waziko International Limited. Huh. Waziko. The great Waziko. 
<laughs> wow, you look you look quite uh, young for your status. <laughs> I get to hear that every day, you know. Uh, the famous Waziko. Hey, my, you know, my problems are solved. Onya Bunko, very rich guy. Everybody knows him. Uh, <laughs> You're right. Um, Waziko, this is my friend, OJ. CEO OJ Oil and Gas. He's the one I told you about to help. And uh, OJ, mm -hmm. this is Waziko. Everybody knows him. <laughs> like I said, I have spoken to him and he has promised to help. It's okay. You see, Sophia here is my very good friend. It's not possible to turn down her request where well, I know I can fully assist. So, uh, Mr. Oji, you don't have to worry, okay? Thank you so much, my brother. Believe me, I need this help. Thank you. Thank yeah. you once again. God bless you. past experience, you won't be blinded by love anymore. Make hay while the sun shines, a war is enough for the wise. 
Anyway, I brought this for you so you can change with. in my house, what's you give me? husband accused you of attacking him last night in a witch-like form and also found a, a charm in your bag. Yes, father. The devil has sworn not to rest until he destroys your family. Did you embark on, on, on the fast and prayer I asked you to do? You did. I did. I did. It's all right. You see, Jeremiah 29, verse 11 says, I know the thought I have towards you. The thought of peace and not evil. To give you a future and hope. Yes. Okay, it goes down to verse 12 and says, If you need out and pray, I'll talk to me. See you. We're in this together, okay? I 
have to talk to your husband. Okay? Thank you. Don't worry. It's going to be alright. I'll bow down your head and receive God's blessings. Father, I told you. Huh? I warned you. I said it. If this happens again, or may again, there will be no consideration from me. Remember? So why are you here? No, tell me, why are you here? You're here to beg me again. So I will take that witch back into my house. Go home. Oh, well. So that she will kill me. And when she kills me, they are mass. You will be there to, to, to celebrate mass for me so that I will be buried. Okay, Father Padamiko, with due respect, just leave this topic. Believe me, because if you try to solicit for her again, Father, you will trigger the beast in me and you will not like it. Biko. It, it's okay, my brother. It's all right. Please, calm down. But let's not give the devil a chance. Of course not. There is no way I will give the devil a chance because Amanda is the devil and I've driven her out of my house. So how else will she have chance? How will the devil have chance to operate in my house? How? On Nagun? Father Biko, I'm done with this topic. Have a nice day. See, my sister, I understand your situation and feel your pain as well. Yes. You see, what your husband is doing, he is doing it out of ignorance. He doesn't know what he's doing. He needs our prayer. He needs your prayer and my prayer too. We need to pray for him constantly, for him to be delivered. The devil hates to see prayer break out among the children of God. We must gather homes with constant intercession. Your husband must be expunged from, from the doldrums of, of, of spiritual uh, fatigue and blindness. He isn't now. It could be, it could be, it could be chaotic, cataclysmic or, or catastrophic if we don't do it on time. He needs our help. Okay. You see, the parish house is still free for you to stay. As long as you want. The whole congregation is solidly behind you, okay? Father, I want to thank you for your kindness and support, especially for accommodating me for the past few days in the parish house. Thank you very much. But as it stands now, I have taken a decision to go back to my father's house in the village. I, I want to I want to go back. But you cannot go back to the village now. You just lost your mother only two years ago. I know. I know, but I'll be fine. God, God Almighty is my strength. I'll be fine. You know, going back to the village will be a kind of uh, psychological, uh, emotional trauma to you. I'll be fine. Well, I thank God Almighty for the courage He has given to you in this time of need. God will be your strength, okay? I thank God Almighty for, for, for your courage, okay?
Oduma, you have done a great job. Now that we have inflicted him with the first plague, which is matrimonial disaster, and successfully taking our enemies, whose careless prayers has been a great obstacle, it is now time to inflict him the second plague. And then the last, which is death. He must suffer before dying for his great disobedience and challenge to rush me. <laughs> The great Uriabara, have a little more mercy. Let him suffer the first and the second plague. His life could even be worse than his death. Please, but don't take the life of my only son. Don't speak like a stranger. There is no mercy with Oriaba. Whatever I have spoken must be done. Don't forget what we suffer because of him. He must die. <laughs> Enjoy your stay here. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> um, right now, you're the only woman in my life. You are the only woman that I love. You are the only person who can fill the vacuum in my heart. What are you saying? What vacuum? your wife because I know you are still married to her Amanda Amanda is history now I'm done with her so it's you and I forever I'll give you the details later but please don't say no
Dad, what about mom? Why do you drive her out from the house? We need her back. Mommy, it's a long story, but you have nothing to worry about. Auntie Sophia is here, she'll be taking mommy's place, okay? And trust her, she'll do a very good job. So, meet Auntie Sophia. <laughs> How are you kids? Oh, fine. Okay. <laughs> Honey, <laughs> your kids are lovely. Oh. Okay, may I know your names? My name is Sophia, let me start from you. Tell me. Me? Yeah, you. My name is Wamaka. Oh, and you? I'm Manuel. Don't worry about them. Uh, you're just meeting them for the first time, so this is, uh, it's normal. Huh? After a while, you guys will get to know each other, I believe. I hope Things so. Change. All right? Enjoy your program. Okay. Sit, sit, sit. Let me show you to your room. Um, don't worry, please, okay? Even if your mom is not here, trust me, I'll be there to take care of both of you. We don't hmm? need now eat your food. We don't need you, mommy. Excuse me. Excuse me. That was very disrespectful. I apologize. Sorry. Listen to me, Junior. You have to get used to the fact that your mom is she's gone. Right? She did a lot of bad things to daddy, so she's not coming back. This is a worthy replacement for your mother, so get used to it. Daddy, please we need mommy. Hey. Shh. Eat. Daddy, please. Daddy, please, mommy. One more word from you, you will see the other side of me.
I came to see my kids, but but the gate man wouldn't let me. Of course he will not allow you, because it's my house, or bro your house. You hear me? And you're no longer welcome in here. Win no? What what do you want to stand for? What why do you want to see my children? So you you will attack them the way you attack me, okay? He won't those kids. I told you before, I don't want to see you here. Don't push me. Win no? I don't want to see you in this compound around this vicinity. Say about or else you will push me to do something drastic. <laughs> Have you had something to eat? Yes. Uh, stay right here. Huh? Stay, stay, stay. Don't, don't worry, I'll, I'll give it to you. Right, don't leave this room. right to know what is happening to you, why they brought us here. Easy now, take it easy. I told you before, it's some little issue I'm, I'm, I'm having with uh, in my business, but Dollar Man, my, my friend, will soon be here. Once he gets here, we'll sort it out. Huh? <laughs> I hope so. It's hey, Sophia. Yes, yes, something is over. more than serious. Look, this is a nightmare I had many years ago. It's it's bad. It's something I would not wish on any man. Believe me, a poor believer. I'm only telling you as my friend because truth be told, you're my only true friend. That's why I'm confiding in you. This is strange. This is serious. Okay, uh, let's try pastor. Oh no, pastors. It's not up on there. Then he lived mad with those people, man. I've had a terrible experience with a pastor in the past. Mm -hmm. They're all the same, just leave them. And what about an herbalist? Herbalist? Yes. <laughs> leave, leave herbalist for now. They can't really do much. Leave them. Okay, you must try an option here. Brother, listen, that was in the past. This is the present. 
All right, fine. I'll think about it. But before then, look. My children, all right, you know their kids. I don't want them to stay with me in the house. Why are these things happening? It's big. It's not, not for the children, okay? I want them to stay with you, please. For now. Okay, please. Okay? All right. OJ. I think I have an idea. Huh? An idea? Yes. Oh, okay. What, what's the idea? Just coming from the church, I went to see Father Timothy, but I couldn't find him, and his phone is switched off. Do you know how I can reach him? No, he traveled outside the country just yesterday. Huh? Traveled abroad? It's anything really the matter, sir. Stench in the air.
It go no good. I've done it again. Don't you worry yourself. No evil shall attack you and your household henceforth. Great. Great one. Are you sure? Do you question Igunugu? I bet you with my life. I shall spend the night with you to complete the task. Uh, Goji, you don't have to worry anymore. Okay? It's settled. Let's look at the kids. <laughs> Um, don't leave, huh? Don't do Don't leave, huh? Don't do Don't leave, huh? Don't leave, huh? This man and what is he doing here? I demand an answer right now. Uh, why you're not? Easy. Uh, you just asked a simple question. Calm down, let me answer. He's a priest. Okay, he's purifying the house against evil spirits. Purifying the house against evil spirits? And since when has your house started breeding evil spirits? I guess I don't know you anymore. But let me make this clear to you. If this man does not leave this house this minute, then I will leave. Yeah. He hasn't gotten to this now. Relax. You're getting worked up over nothing. Calm down. Chopolo, uh, Mabu, this man. Huh? Have you had any encounter with him before? What's the problem? What he's doing is for our own good. Relax. Really? Yes. at me. As you can see, I am leaving. I can't marry a man who suddenly acts funny. First, you were screaming the whole house down. And then you took us out without any reasonable explanation. Coming back here to the house is with chief priest being your so-called purification. OJ, do I look like a fool to you? Huh? It is obvious you are diabolic. Yes, it is obvious you are diabolic or even a ritualist. Huh? Yes. But well, you know what? I am leaving you for good. Before my life goes down with this. Yes! You can't say such a thing, Narela. Let me explain. Yes. I don't need your explanation. Save it to who cares to listen. Excuse me. Don't kill me.
come. And you, how dare you interfere? You evil one, your time is up. You must leave. How dare you challenge me? Rather, you must leave now. Never. I can see you are very stubborn. No. I still don't understand why you're doing what, what's going on. Allow this guy to do his job. Okay, me. What is going on right now is I am leaving your house for good. Yes, that is what is going on. Excuse me. I've been begging you inside. Don't do this. Now. You, you can't do this to me. Pico, no. Uh, do, do, don't do this. Now. I'm begging you. You're all I have now. Don't. Igunu, how dare you stand on my way? You shall see. the great god of old. I know you, powerful Zaguma, my own. How dare you jeopardize the mission of my servant Atama. You should stay away to avoid my wrath. Nothing comes in between me and my mission. Not even you. Then, be prepared to face my wrath. Now, you can see that your power is not much for Oriabara. This is only a warning, Zaguma. You! 
Kati Guru, what happened to you? The evil did this to me. Hey. Ikunu, you are a failure. You are a big failure. So you couldn't even defeat an ordinary crocodile. Eh? And you kept on posting that you, you, you are the greatest. No, 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 Just look at yourself. Eh? Then get out of my house. I shouldn't have tried to help you. In great. Help you. Can, can you help yourself? Ikunu, can you help yourself? Okay, I'm going to get out. I shall go, but your problem shall consume you. Bolaba, that guy is fake. That's your business. He's fake. Fake. O -O OJ, calm down. Look, if one door closes, another will open. When will the door open? Eh? Is it when I die? I told you what all I've been going through. Is it when I die and you bury me? Is that when the door will open? I'm telling you that I'm not... Yes, hello. Huh? Okay, what is this? Refinery and all your filling stations you just recovered not too long ago from Sophia's business transaction has been raised down by fire not too long ago. Same day, how could this happen to you? How could this happen to you? Not quite long, you've just been bankrupt. I sense special forces. Yes. Your enemy is at work. Someone is walking towards your progress. OJ, who do you suspect? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 I can't lay my hands on, you know, anybody. I, you know, someone I'll say that this person is the cause. I, I, I don't know, but... Hey, Dollar Man, that is not even the issue. That's not even the issue. The issue is that I borrowed a lot of money. Eh, hey, Dollar Man? I borrowed, a, I borrowed so much money to, 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 to do this deal. And not just that, I, I invested everything I have. Believe me, so this deal, it just can't go like that. I need to get the money back. Believe me, if I can't get this money back, Dollar Man, I'm, I'm finished. Honestly, everything I've ever labored for, I invested in this thing. If I can't get it back, I'm gone. It's your Naba village. Believe me. Hi, hey, it's better I just die. Don't no, 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 no. It's okay. OJ, when there is life, there is hope. Hey, there's no hope. Oh. Hey, you won't understand the pain of this thing. Too. Hey! OJ, don't let this get over you now. OJ. 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 He's already getting to my chest. Your chest? OJ! OJ! No, 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 no! Hello, manager. Yes, manager, I don't understand what is going on. No, tell me, you tell me, what's going on? I tried right now to do a transfer from my account. And it's telling me that I have, uh, I don't have sufficient funds in the account. I don't have money. Yes, right? I said I wasn't able to make a, a small transfer from my account. Hey, God, was it there? What's going on? Listen, I don't understand what you're saying. I'm coming to the bank right now. I just see that this company was a fraud. 
a complete fraud. I didn't know that that company was, was a total fraud. I mean, those guys, they were taking advantage of my online transactions with them. They were using it to monitor my account and they brought me down to zero level. I'm telling you, these guys cleaned out my account completely. Hi. Hi. What was I thinking? Just in a few days, Dollar Man. Just in a few days, they have been brought down to nothing. I've lost everything. Hi. Hi. Can you believe that? Me. Me. I can't have me ego. Me. The money I have in my account right now cannot even feed me and my family, my children, for up to a month. OJ, calm down. Stop beating yourself. All hope is not lost. No, all hope is lost, my brother. Tola man. Tola man. Tola man. Hey, go blue gong gong go mazi. The whole world will laugh at me. Hey. Let them see whatever they like. It's your life, not theirs. Sister Chema Umana, how are you? Fine, fine. I have come to see you and to know how you are coping in this your present predicament. I have known you to be a good Christian with high moral standard, worthy of emulation. I want you to know that your whole church is solidly behind you. Yes. I also want you to know we are aware that what your husband is going through is not ordinary. It is my prayer that the good Lord will deliver him from this bondage. Amen, amen. Thank you, Father. Honestly, I am, I am super excited that you visited. And my, my soul is so delighted, knowing fully well that God himself and the entire congregation are solidly behind me. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you. That's okay, sister. Bow down your head, let me pray for you. He has indeed felt the wrath of a river. Doom and tears are my pledge. Now he must face the last plague. That tomorrow night. He must die. Oh, Sister Amanda, how are you? Really? Oh, I, I had a bad revelation about him too. You see, I want you to come to the Paris house to see me unfailingly today, please. Yes. Uh, you see, despite the fact that I came back from, I just returned from abroad today, 
I want you to come to the parish house now to see me. Thank you. You see, it's never too late to answer the Lord's call. Yes. You must come to the parish house now. It's, it's, it's a matter of life and death. Okay? Yes, brother. Very well then. Bye for now. Even though it's the love from your heart, they will hate you for no reason. For even for those of you you sacrificed, will leave you without remorse. They will accuse you. Tonight is the night that his blood becomes our sacrifice. This night he joins us. Daga of sacrifice. You shall be given to the angel of death for this task. Yes, I have arrived the city. Not quite long, Father. Yes, you said if I arrive late, I should call you to come and pick me up. I don't really know the place, but I think it's around ShopRite or something. I don't know. I'm seeing the signboard. Yes, Father. Okay, thank you. I'll be waiting. Thank you. Humble servants of Oriobara, 
sent to torment this household. What's going on here? Oh my God. Wait, wait, wait. I thought you said you're an orphan. Yes, that was part of my assignment too. Everything about me was part of the task. We have been tormenting your household spiritually because of your disobedience to Oriobara. It started from the lady, Sophia, who got into your life and made your husband spiritually weak, thereby giving us way to penetrate. Your sexual relationship with her was being of our mission. She turned your mind against your wife and your so-called God. She was a loyal servant of Oriobara, sent to destroy you just like me, to chatter your household and get rid of your wife, who was an obstacle to our mission. My mission started the moment you started offering me money in front of the church. We rendered your husband spiritually weak. We made him to love money more than his God. Then, Amanda, you led me into your house to fulfill my mission. Everything about me was part of the mission. Just like Atama, whom your husband taught she was a beautiful lady. I started tormenting your household. The moment you started offering me money, rendering your husband spiritually weak, I am responsible for your recent family problems. The plan to get you out of the way so that my mission will be done. Because you are an obstacle to us. At night, my mission will be done. <laughs> Is the completion of the mission. You're a liar! You have no authority or power over life and death. Only mighty God does. I can see you stubborn. Get out of the way, or all of you will die. The Bible said, Touch not my anointed, or do my prophets no harm. The mighty Lord has decreed, you cannot harm me, any of them. Life! And you take it, the mighty name of Jesus. I come against you. I come against you now. Take it. The mighty name of Jesus. Take it. I said take it. In the mighty name of Jesus. Take it. Go back to that this way you want. Now in the mighty name of Jesus. Out. I come against you. Out. I come against you. You can't resist the power. No, you cannot. I said you cannot resist the power. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. In Jesus name. The mighty name of Jesus. Thank you so much, Father. Oh, we thank God Almighty who has uh, won this battle for us through Master Jesus Christ our Lord. Shall we be on our feet, please? Save me. I've 
hurt you so much. Please, forgive me for all I've done to you. In every way I've wronged you, forgive me. But thank God we've conquered him once again. Amen, and so shall it be forever. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hmm. Father, I'm so ashamed of myself. I've sinned so much against God Almighty. I made a promise to him that I would never deviate from his ways. I just, just, just need good news. Just look at me. I don't even know if he, he will ever forgive me for everything I've done, for all my sins against him. Father, please help me pray to God for my forgiveness. You see, my brother, our God is a merciful God. No matter how terrible your sins are, or how many times you've sinned against him. Once you have a repentant heart, he's ever willing to forgive you. And he is going to forgive you. Mm -hmm. It's just that sometimes as human beings, we are deficient and obstinate. Once you humble yourself before God, you know, he will forgive you. It's just that you erred in your promises, thereby giving the devil a chance to manipulate you, rendering you spiritually weak, but henceforth, if you stay close to God, making your altar evil, no weapon fashioned against you or your family by the devil shall prosper again in Jesus' name. Amen. We should cultivate hands for the, the, the habit of living for something rather than dying for nothing. Live for Christ. Eat Christ. Discuss Christ. Sleep Christ. Drink Christ. I'll take a cue from uh, Philippians 4, verses 6 to 7. God says, and the peace which passeth all understanding shall be with you, be with your hearts and mind through Christ Jesus. Amen. Bow down your heads and receive God's praise. Mighty Father. Thank you.